And so we say goodbye to the 2016 summer and the Commodore season. They fall in game three of the Cape League Championship to the Whitey Red Sox by a final of three to nothing. And Josh, it was close all throughout, but why couldn't they get back in this one? Well, I think the balk early on in the game just sucked the life right out of this Commodores team. You look at it overall, Whitey only gave up two hits tonight. The bullpen was locked down for the Red Sox. A lot of strikeouts, and although Falmouth did work a lot of walks, not enough hits to keep those runners moving and to push runs across the board. Now, Chris, the team is saying goodbye as we speak. They're hugging host families. Tears are flowing. How have you seen this team evolve and kind of grow together over the summer? Yeah, obviously really tough. A very special season. Over 50 games in the season for the Commodores as they won the West and made the playoffs. And obviously tonight in just one game, it's not an indicative sample size of how the team played this year. And you really can tell afterwards how close these guys have come. And I think you have to credit the coaching staff. They did a terrific job at allowing these guys to gel in a very special season. They finished last in the West last year. And obviously getting to the championship game is a tremendous feat and they should be proud of that. Now, we rarely talk about ourselves, but Josh, this has been an incredible summer for all of us in the broadcast team. What are you going to remember? I think overall it's just coming to the ballpark every day, watching the best college talent in the country take batting practice, for us to just come down and interact with them. They were so welcoming, so friendly, always cracking jokes with us. It was just a great environment for us to work in and something I'm never going to forget. Now, Chris, what's going to stand out for you as well? You know, on a similar note, I think it is just coming to the field every single day. It's a great experience to be around the team, and it's really the coaching staff that will stand out to me. Coach Trundy sets a terrific example, and it makes our job really easy and, more importantly, very fun. And I think interacting with the players and being able to just call baseball and be around a sport that we all love on an everyday basis in front of a beautiful Cape Cod sunsets, mm -hmm. it's really just been a terrific summer, and I know that it will be one that we'll never forget. Well, that does put a wrap on the 26th season. I, season. I know I speak for the entire Commodores organization. We want to extend a thank you to everyone that's watched and followed this team throughout the entire summer. It's really one that us as broadcasters will never forget. And with that, for the entire broadcast team in Pat's Loft, our videographer right behind the camera right now, Cam Segrew, our social media, Kara Peterson, digital writer, Alex Schley, our PA announcer, Brandon Ball. He is Josh Hess. This is Chris Pichet, and I'm Blake Bernard, and we say so long to a memorable 2016 summer.